Hey guys, welcome to episode 2, mission 2 of our Let's Play Space Hulk series. I've got to admit again, man, just look at the view of this. We're just going down a lift with some pipes. And it just looks awesome. Okay, so for this one, we've got to destroy the engine. And nothing can be done hastily. A little bit of banter going on there. Let's just ignore that glitch of the feet through the floor. Okay. Let's go this way. You know, for whatever flaws a game might have, if you start playing it and the second you play it, you feel like you are in the, the world that it is set then it, they've done a good job. I feel like I'm a Terminator stalking around a Space Hulk here. Now, I am a little worried about how the AI is going to continue. There we go, some cultists. Because every review I put, I saw, sorry, was that this game isn't a fun single player game due to the AI mainly. However, I thoroughly enjoyed the first mission and the AI did a fairly decent job. There was that one occasion where he was... One of these guys. There was that one occasion where he was shooting the pipe and stepped in front of me, but apart from that, I didn't really have any issues, but obviously the further into the... Oh, man. The further into the game I go... tougher things are going to get. And I'm... Oh man, sorry, guys. I'm a little worried about... Obviously, I can't be everywhere at once, so if I'm on the point, I'm dependent on them covering the rear. And as you can see, he's already taken a fair bit of damage. But, we will progress. Just look at this. It's awesome. I'd love it if we get to see some falling in this game. That would be awesome. Ooh. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Back on topic. No time for sightseeing. Just under 160 meters to go. Ooh, what was that? That sounded like a grenade or a rocket. Ooh, here we go. Cheeky guy over there. Oh, there's another one. We are the angels of death. I wonder if there's any levels in this where it's just pitch black. The power's gone out, it's pitch black, and all you've got is your torchlight. I mean, that would be extremely hard with the franticness of it, but it would feel that little bit more kind of true Space Hulk, if you know what I mean. Don't get me wrong, like I said, they've done an amazing job. I feel like I'm within a Space Hulk. But you're just used to it being those pitch black corridors and the, the power out, the, the more of like the, the tense investigation of it all. We've kind of moved into non-stop action mayhem territory now. Ooh, has he got a stubber? Okay. Hmm. 
looks a bit suspicious, doesn't it? This one entrance. Okay. Can't remember your name, so you're just gonna have to be F1 and F2. F1 is taking quite a fair bit of damage. Maybe worth healing up before we go in there. Okay, full heal. Let's get out of there. Alright, good job guys. Okay. I'm expecting... Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, there's a plasma turret or something. Uh, hack, hack. How do I hack? Scan. Has that worked? Has that worked? I should have disabled it. This has gone kind of crazy, and we've already taken a ton of damage just from that turret. Oh, the side gates are limited. Just saw the number two above that. Didn't realize that. I thought they were unlimited. Okay. Right, so now I'm only going to have one side gate left. Okay. Hey, he's got a death watch arm on. I then just noticed that. Stop. How many gene stealers are on this vessel? Just took a rocket launcher to the back. Okay, the noise of this is getting a bit annoying. This is just, come on. Give me a break at least. Let's just push on, guys. There's no point hanging around. The waves are non stop. Um, I right oh, don't tell me I've gone the wrong way. I've gone the wrong way. Great. It's the other side. Sorry, guys. Oh. Body's chained to him. True grim dark, and I'm just taking a rocket launcher. Okay, last side gate teleport. Thinking I maybe need to be a little bit more observant in my surroundings here. I keep not catching those turrets and they're really costing me. I'm just a bit too worried about taking too much time because the constant waves just gradually overwhelm my teammates. That's 
more satisfying. The melee is awesome. Why is this beeping now? Destroy the nest of Xenos. Xenos. See, I always call it Xeno. Overwhelmed again. Guys, we're just gonna have to push on here, I think. Non stop. That false lightning, for want of a better word, does not do much damage. Oh my lord. I'm nearly down, I'm nearly down. Guys, it's getting a bit of cover. We are the angels of death. Vengeance dies our weapons. They are This is not going to go well. We're nearly dead. Or at least I'm nearly dead. And we're walking towards a Xeno nest. Oh, he's nearly down as well. Bring it back, bring it back. Mission accomplished, brother. Got half his health back. I wonder if you can heal me. Operation finished. Oh, okay. Okay. I thought that was armor damage. It's not, it's just your health in general. So the apothecary can uh, heal your armor. Okay, note to self for the future. Don't waste all the Psygate so quickly, use the apothecary instead. Oh dear. I really should have been paying more attention back in the tutorial. Serves me right. I want to know why that guy's still got his Deathwing arm on. Deathwing. Death Watch arm on. And when you return to the chapter, you have to uh, abandon that kind of stuff. Right, let's activate these. This is not going to be good in here, guys. They're going to be non stop duty stealers. I'm getting hit by them. I'm getting. Oh, like a tiny one. Right. In and out fast, in and out fast. Oh, non stop. Oh, no, I, I'm on red already. What is going on here? Get stuck in. Come on. Unless there was one behind me that I didn't see, I appear to have gone from full health to... Am I dead? Oh, man. You've got to be. Your precognition abilities warn you that you've been terminated by a lightly armed hybrid. I didn't even see that lightly armed hybrid, so I'm guessing it was behind me. Oh, man. This game's tough. Not going to lie. Really enjoying it, though. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I may have failed miserably on this one, but I'm thoroughly enjoying the journey.
As always, huge thank you for your support, guys. If you're new, please consider liking and subscribing to help the channel grow. And if you enjoyed this particular vid, then why not drop a like on it too? But with that said, I am off and I'll see you all again real soon. Oh, man.